Anna from A Does Life here and I have a Dollar Tree haul for you guys and yes, yeah, so excited. Lots of Dollar Tree items, so let's get into it. All right, the first items, if you've seen some of my previous videos, you know that I got a horrible, like horrible sunburn, like third degree burns, like 75% of my body, like that bad, like that bad. It was, and I had blisters and it was just, it was just bad, really bad. So anyway, um, I need some sunblock. So the next time I went to the Dollar Tree, I found all three of these products and I'm like, I'm just buy them all, just buy them all. All right, the first um, was some much needed uh, aloe vera. And luckily I had some, but I have used like almost all of it this week because yeah, we've been lathering that stuff on. So um, it's always, always great to have this stuff on hand, whether it's for sunburns, you know, it is summer now, or any kind of burns. It's really great. And then I bought these two sunblocks. Uh, one is um, kids sunscreen, uh, SPF 50, and it is water resistant for 80 minutes. Maybe that's what I should use. And then the next is sunscreen SPF 45, um, uh, water resistant 80 minutes. Um, they did have an SPF 15, but, um, and like once my sunburn is kind of down, like maybe I'll go back and get that one or something but but i right now i just don't want any sun like right now i'm still like it's been almost a week and i'm still sore yeah still sore so um yeah no sun no more sun for me i normally don't burn that bad i normally um you know i mean maybe a little bit but nothing like i did this time i don't know what happened well you know i need to water what you know anyway um, so anyway, these are great buys. If you go to Walmart, you cannot purchase sun, sunblock for like, it's like six or seven dollars. It is so expensive and it's not any bigger than this. Like it is, it's so expensive. And so I'm hoping that, um, this will work well. I'm sure, I'm sure it will. Um, yeah. And so what a great deal for a dollar. Uh, if you have these and if you see these in your Dollar Tree, pick them up. And in fact, I probably should have picked up like a couple of each um, just to have on hand, like because we spend a lot of time at the pool in the summer. So absolutely pick these up. Like I said, we do spend a lot of time um, or we do plan to spend a lot of time. We've only went once so far and we've just been busy with things. And anyway, we love the pool. And so um, anyway, I picked up um, some of these water balls. I saw when we were at the pool, um, some people playing with these and they look so much, like so much fun. So basically they're just kind of like squishy, like almost like Nerf ball like uh, feeling. And but they like soak up water and you can throw them back and forth. I thought the boys would like that, and I got one kind of big one from the throat, and then I got, uh, there was a pack of two smaller ones, so I thought those were a good deal and something fun that they could play with at the pool. I picked up these, and I don't know how well they're going to work. They are ultra foam shots, so they're like Nerf bullets. My oldest son has suddenly became, like he's uh, 13, and he suddenly became very interested in Nerf guns. Um, not just Nerf guns, but like, rebuilding them like taking them apart and making them do different things I don't know um uh, he likes them and it gives him something to do but anyway I don't know if these will work or not I don't know but they were just a buck for um 16 pieces so I thought that that was something that he could kind of play around with and you know see if they'll work I bought another package of these coin wrappers. Um, I have bought, I think I'd hauled these not too long ago when we had, we keep a change jar that we just throw all of our change in. And anyway, um, we, we rolled it over. There was like a $400 worth of change. And anyway, I didn't, when we were finished with that, I had used a lot, most of these coin wrappers. I mean, I have some of them, but I mean, we were out of like the quarter ones and things like that. And anyway, it, we just accumulate a lot of change and, and we had a garage sale recently. And so I just thought it'd be a good idea to pick up some more of those so that they're easier so we can take them to the bank and things. You can you can take your roll change to um, one of those coin machines and it'll count it for you, but I feel like it's high. I feel like it's expensive to do that. And anyway, it's just, you know, it's just like, it's fun extra money every once in a while. Like, like oh wow, we have $100 we didn't know we had. Let's go to Silver Dollar City or let's go do something fun. And it's basically free because we didn't know we had the money. Anyway, 
so that's that. Um, I got these hair clips. I don't know if I had never noticed them or whatever, but I looked for them because Sarah from Something Different had, and I'll link her below, had um, had hauled these a few weeks ago, and um, I, I'm, I've lost a lot of my, I have several of the like, um, actually like beauty supply clips or whatever, but I don't know over, I don't know what happened, they break, they lost, I'm not sure. But anyway, um, I've only got like a couple left. And so these are great for doing um, your hair to clip it out of the way when I'm straightening it or curling it or whatever I'm doing. And so anyway, yeah, they were in fun colors. I think they have black and white ones, but I'm not wearing them. I'm like, they're, you know, they're to clip my hair. So I bought the fun color ones, four for a dollar. That's a super good deal. I bought a spatula, a slotted turner is what it's called. I almost called it a pancake turner, but I don't know if that's like kind of a uh, Midwest Southern <laughs> term or not. But anyway, uh, I needed a new metal one. I have several like coated ones for like that I use on coated pans because you don't want to use a metal one on a metal pan. But my main pan set is stainless steel. It's um, it's we have a really nice pan set, and so uh, I can use this kind of uh, spatula on it and I am I'm really picky I don't like flimsy ones and I don't know it seems like the last couple I bought was flimsy but this one felt really tough so we're gonna give it a try it may not be but we're gonna give it a try okay moving on all right I did buy um, some marigold seeds. Um, I've said this in about every Dollar Tree haul video because I feel like I'm always picking up something um, that has to do with this. My son is allergic to mosquitoes, and um, they just it just swells up, and he just they're just very attracted to him. And so I've been wanting to get some marigold seeds to plant because I hear uh, mosquitoes aren't real fond of them. And heck, they're pretty too, right? So whatever. Um, let's see, move on. We don't have as many things this time, so it's gonna be fairly quick. Oh, okay, so you guys know my two favorite things to pick up at Dollar Tree. Stickers or washi tape, like anything planner related, and socks. Well, I got both. <laughs> well, I, I didn't get any socks for me. I looked and I just didn't find any that I um, that I liked or, or what have you, but I did get a package for my son red, black, and blue. He is playing baseball, or t-ball, um, right now, and their team colors are red, so I thought those would be kind of cute. He doesn't have to wear, like, baseball socks. It's just t-ball, so he just wears socks. So, anyway, those would be cute. Um, and then I picked up three pair for a dollar. is super good deal. Um, this washi tape, this was the only kind of washi tape my Dollar Tree had. My Dollar Tree rarely gets washi tape, and if they do, I grab it. Like, I've no, like, they don't have any of the big packages, like, none of that but um when they do get it in i grab it and so this is kind of cute oh i dropped it um it is scotch scotch brand and it is the alphabet can you guys see that is it i can't tell if it's upside down but anyway i thought that might be cute um for um like back to school time um, um and everything so i bought that and besides i can't pass it uh, washi tape. Okay, these were super fun. I bought these. My brother loves origami, and so I'm always sending him like origami stuff. He just he just loves it, and um, it's kind of a long story. I won't get into it, but anyway, he loves origami, and um, I bought yeah. So anyway, this is a uh, there's like farm animals. Um, and then there's a zoo one, and then this one was cool, it's airplanes. Anyway, I bought those for my brother. Oh, I guess I did buy another pool thing. I bought this, um, like, uh, is it like a dinosaur dragon? I'm not sure. But anyway, like, maybe like a baby dragon or something. Uh, I had bought, um, you see me haul, uh, a few weeks ago, the um, swim rings, I bought um, the, the like inner tube ones. I bought one that looked like an inner tube and one that looked like a giant donut, which was so cute because, you know, we're a police family and yeah, I love the donut. And it popped. Um, I don't know, like, if it got a whole, like, I'm not sure what happened. Like, we were at the pool and it just kept going down. We inflated it and then we noticed it had, like, a little cut in it. So I don't know if just something snagged on it, but 
Anyway, that was sad. I can't find them now, so oh well. Um, but anyway, I got this one to kind of replace it. Um, it it'll just be something different that um, my little boy can play around with. That he'll enjoy that. And uh, then I got two like makeup beauty items. Um, I had hauled one of these a few weeks ago and really liked it. It's the blender makeup sponge, and I couldn't find them again. And so I ended up just buying one because I do like it, but then I sometimes I end up just not using it. I just use my hands or other like wedges or something. So I just bought one more of those, but I thought those were, they are really nice to have. And then I picked up some of the goodie hair ties. I, um, I'm really picky about hair ties. I want them, I have a lot of hair. Like this is like straightened and yet it's still a lot of hair. I need to, I need to get it to the salon. But anyway, um. So there's just seven of those, and if you're like me, you lose hair ties and bobby pins are like crazy. And so I do, so I picked up those. So that's it, friends. Not as many things, or maybe we just went through it a little faster this week. But I was super excited. My, my favorite buys were definitely the um, summer stuff that has came out, the sunscreen and the pool toys and things like that. I'm super excited because even at Dollar General, they're two or three dollars, and for the pool um, stuff, the goggles and everything. And so I'm just super excited about having all of those, and it's just fun. Um, I'm going to. Try try to take my boys to the pool about once a week or go swimming a, kind of once a week and um, that's kind of our plan we didn't um we hadn't in the, the first few weeks of summer vacation but i'm going to try to kind of do that the rest of the summer so it's just kind of nice even if i can just pick up something new you know um each week you know just something something different for them to play with they just they enjoy it not that they get bored at the pool they love the pool but all that anyway so anyway, thanks for watching guys. I've got a lot of videos coming up in the next few weeks and a giveaway, so be sure to stay tuned. Uh, thanks for spending time with me today. Be sure to subscribe to my channel, like this video, leave me a comment, and thanks guys.